everyone I'm back and I am now going to do my June favorites and I have them in this little pink basket right here so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started I have been using my Evian um, facial spray like pretty much every day because it's just like getting so so hot but this is just really refreshing so um, I've been using like I said that pretty much on a daily basis and I'm really liking the Wet n Wild um, palettes that I purchased earlier in the month. They are very pigmented and um, I did do a video to kind of compare some of the colors with um, the some of the matte colors that I have that were pretty good dupes in my opinion. So I have that. Um, I'm really loving this lip balm. This is the one from EOS, and this one is in lemon. And I just love the smell of lemons. Um, you might have, you've probably seen this all over YouTube also, um, but this is my favorite of the three scents. I also have like the fruity one and the honeydew melon one but this one is my favorite so I've been really liking that I've also been really liking my quarters lip butter um, in guava and it is very very smooth that's what it looks like um, and also from Kors I'm really really liking this lipstick that I bought in rose so this is the color right there and let's see if you can see a swatch but that's the color right there it's really pretty um, another lip product that I'm liking is from the Sally Hansen natural beauty inspired by Carmen D this one is in plum shimmer so it's a um, darker plum color that sit on the bottom and I actually like pairing it with this um, natural shine lip gloss also from the same brand and I'm really liking these glosses a lot because I really love the lip wand and let's see if I can get you to see what the color kind of looks like together so I usually blend it out a little bit more so it's not as dark but um, I'm really enjoying wearing those two together and that's it in terms of lip products um, I tried this out for the last couple of weeks this is the Maybelline Falsies Volume Express and I know some people on YouTube um, aren't really a fan of this but for me, I think the reason why it works really well is because my eyelashes are so thin. And so they actually really give me a lot more volume and length than um, what I usually have. So that's what the wand looks like. And I actually, this was the only one left in the store, so it's in the brown-black color. Um, but this is actually something that I will purchase again um, in black so for me it works I've also been using my getaway bronze powder blush from the Mac back to the beach collection I've been using this almost every day too as my um, kind of just like an all-over color and sometimes I put a little bit more in my um, cheeks and not even wear a separate blusher I just I mean this is a blusher so I've been using that a lot. I've also been using the MAC um, Naked Pigment. This is my favorite pigment of the MAC colors. And for polishes, I've really been enjoying this, this one, which is in Tangelo Sherber. It's a really pretty color. And I've been wearing this on my toenails. Um, I've also been liking this, let's see, this is from Soap and Glory, and it's called 
the Phil Monte, Phil Monte, and it is a instant facial line filler. And really, what I've been using this for more is just as a like a pr a primer, um, more around my eyes. So it's quite thick, but I would say that it does a pretty good job smoothing um, the lines out. Um, I've also, I showed this in my pre-samples video, the Secret Clinical Strength um, deodorant and antiperspirant works actually pretty good in my opinion. So again, if you're looking for something strong, I recommend that one. And then the last product that I'm going to show you guys is my um, Revlon Photo Finish. I've been wearing the 004 in nude and um, I'm liking the way this um, feels on my face when I'm trying to achieve a like a medium um, finish and I personally for me think that I photograph well when I use this um, foundation so again that's the Revlon photo ready and that's pretty much it I didn't really have too many other things so if you guys have any questions on any of the products just um, leave a message or a comment and I'll get back to you guys and I hope you guys are having a really good evening and I'll see you guys soon bye